Hey guys, welcome back. It's your boy DJ Reminisce and today I'm going to teach you guys how to properly export your mixtape when it's done for the uh, most bang for your buck quality and of course converting it to mp3. So let's get started. So first things first, you're done with your mix. Now you got to export it from whatever software you're using. Again, I'm using Ableton Suite 9, but it doesn't matter what you use. And the thing you got to remember is, is how much data in terms of size do you want to maintain but yet maintain quality now i'm going to be honest with you i pretty much export mixtapes down to 16-bit 441k that's more than enough and size wise you're going to be fine now in my previous video which i'll link in the description i was talking about the master bus and this is really important because this is where you get to decide how you actually want to export what i do is i use third-party plugins so when i export i trust them on my master fader rather than using ableton's built-in dither to do the uh, export and I'll show you what I mean. So on this track here, um, I've got an L2 on the master. And as you can see, I have it set to 16 bit. So what that means is this is ready to export and it's gonna export properly at 44.1, 16 bits. The other thing you can do is not use a dithering application like L2, you can actually use the built-in software inside your suite. So in Ableton, I'll show you the dithering options. If you go file, export, You'll see right in here, dithering options. Right now, set to triangular. I think that's the default. I'm actually going to set mine to no dither because, again, I'm going to use the L2 as my dithering plugin. Now, you could go through the options and kind of understand what works best for you. Again, it's totally up to you. The rendering track is going to be the master track. And as you can see in here, it's going to be a wave. You got a choice of AIFF. I'm going to keep mine to wave. Sample rate's 44.1, and the bit rate is 16 bits. That's the main thing. Then I click export find the location of where I want to dump it call a wave whatever you want it to be export tutorial and then save and then let it run okay once you've bounced your mix now it's time to convert it to something smaller like an mp3 and the best thing that I found to use is actually iTunes and it's free so I'll show you how to use that so first things first in iTunes let's set up your import settings that's really simple you got to go to edit preferences and right down here is where the import settings are so you click on import settings and right here is the mp3 encoder. You click on mp3 encoder and now this is where you need to decide what's going to work best for you. I've gone and went to the highest quality which is 320 kpbs but you can choose whichever one you want. Again I'm not too concerned about file size but if you guys are concerned about file size my recommendation is to change the stereo bit rate to 128 and have the sample rate at 441k. These settings here will give you an optimal file size and the quality will still be very very good. Now it's really simple. I'm going to take my file, drag it in. It's going to take it for a minute to sync in. So how you convert this to mp3 is really simple. You just click on that guy, go to file, convert, create mp3 version. Now it's going to do its thing. And now here you have the mp3 version on top. Now the cool thing about this, you can do all the tags and everything right in iTunes. So you can click on here, get info. Now you can add your whatever export tutorial. Artist is DJ Reminis. It's already in there. You can add your artwork. And this is fantastic. I'll give you an example of my podcast that I do, this one right here. So if I click in here and go to get info, as you can see, I've done all my tags. And of course, I can add my artwork. I mean, this is really, really easy to use and it's free. That's the best part. So guys, now you got the tools and capability to create some good sounding mixtapes. I hope you guys enjoyed today's tutorial. Please like this video and share it. Subscribe to the channel. That way you stay up to date with the latest, greatest information. I'm your boy, DJ Reminis. Peace out.